Our world is warming. There's absolutely no denying it, and it's warming at an ever-increasing rate. Taking the world records back to about 1880, these are the five warmest years ever recorded, and the most recent one, 2015, of course, but you only have to go back to 2005 to find the sort of fifth-placed year. So this is a trend which is continuing, but it's also visible as you move in to country levels. Take the United States, for instance. Now here, it has been a very mild winter, it's been a warm spring, and it's shaping up to be an exceptionally warm summer. And it's quite possible that summer of 2016 could well find itself at the very top of this list. And again, let's look at this list. It's recent years which are set in the records, going back to 1895. It's only the 1930s where we had the Dust Bowl in the West, which sort of broken up this sequence. So it'll be interesting to see what happens. But it's not just the contiguous United States, this area here but way up towards the 49th state, Alaska, we're seeing exceptional weather at the moment. In fact, I could widen this out to the whole of the Arctic Circle region where we've seen very warm conditions. We've seen temperatures uh, above freezing in the, at the North Pole, for instance. But on Wednesday, we had temperatures of 31 in Fairbanks, which may seem pretty warm, but almost more remarkable is a temperature very close to Prudhoe Bay, just inland, of 29 degrees Celsius. That's about 85 in Fahrenheit. Could you imagine stripping off into your bathing costume and sitting on the shores of the Arctic Sea. That's a Beaufort Sea up there, normally icebound for parts of the year, but the ice, of course, melting. And what we've seen in Alaska has been reflected in many other parts of the globe, and that is why we expect 2016 across the globe to probably be the warmest year ever recorded.